nothing actually dies. Anything that is living will always live. But if you're somebody who has, through your life, had any of these particular experiences, then stay with me. You'll know what I'm talking about. Mediumship is an extrasensory perception. You actually have a different sense of the world, a different sense of people, a different sense of living and dying. But it's a wonderful thing that I believe all of us have the ability to enhance. Everybody has sensitivity. Everybody has awareness to varying degrees. But through my life, I've learned how to extend mine, how to expand into a part of the universe that basically takes away my fear of living, my fear of dying. And that's something that I most want to share with people through my work as a medium. You see, a medium itself is somebody who gets information from another world, from a world where our ancestors go, our loved ones who die. When people think that they have gone forever, it's only the physical body that has gone forever. Even since early on in my childhood, I have known that nobody actually dies. Nothing actually dies. Anything that is living will always live. And that's not just my theory. That actually was the theory of Albert Einstein, the great scientist. He said the energy itself can never die. It just renews itself. And that is something I have come to know of the human spirit. Any class on mediumship has to begin with the self. There's no point of trying to know about what happens after we die from this physical body if you don't know what's going on in this physical body. And that is the journey that I started out on as a very young kid. As a young man in my very early 20s, I had an episode of mediumship, one which I hadn't had since I was a child. So it became a whole new experience as an adult to see somebody standing in front of you who shouldn't normally be there and who actually disappeared through the floor. All of these things defied physics, defied our natural law. So when something like that happens to you, it really makes you wake up. And I believe that for most people who want to know more about mediumship, life after death, the spirit world and things, you're starting to wake up. So it's to you people that I'm really speaking to right now. You have woken up, you've felt something, you've sensed something, you've seen something different from the other people in your life. And for a lot of us, that makes us feel different. I remember when I was younger, I did not want to tell people things that I seen. And I'm sure some of you are the same. You know something's gonna happen and you don't want to say it because you don't want to worry people. You don't want to tell people things, oh my God, that might frighten them. I had all of these things happen until I learned how to actually discipline this. And here is the thing that if you have sensitive or mediumship abilities and it frightens you, the whole idea of my life's journey was to teach people to lose that fear and to use their gifts. Hat dir dieses Video gefallen? Dann abonniere jetzt unbedingt diesen Kanal, denn schon bald findest du hier den nächsten Beitrag von einem deiner Top-Mentoren. Thank you.